What's going on guys and welcome back to another episode of Ark Astraos. Last we left off we tamed a, a couple of lions as well as two star rhinos. I did get a saddle for the rhino, we'll check it out in a minute. But first we need to name a couple of lions. So a couple of you had a few name suggestions for the lions, so... This one here we'll name Kiara. You know, from The Lion King 2, Simba's daughter. And then for this one, I was thinking about naming you Sphinx. I know it's more that's more of an Egyptian name, but it kind of fits the vibe that we're going for. So Kiara actually has a couple levels. We'll look at that in a moment. Oh yeah, off camera, I managed to get some of that mashed insects that we used to tame the, uh, the spiders. And we're going to see if we can go after that spider. I'd like to see if I could go after one early game. I don't know if I have any ghillie armor at the moment. If I do, then all oh, the storage things fall. Hmm. Let's see if I can get rid of something. Maybe the berries? We don't need those berries. I don't have any ghillie armor at the moment. I think it kind of does matter because ghillie armor is kind of, you know, important when it comes to stealth taming. And whatever. Let's see, um, do we have any bug repellent? Uh, bug repellent. Alright. Oh yeah, we need to grow crops for bug repellent. Yeah, I don't think we're ready for bug repellent. What's this? Shark repellent. This distinctive paste makes you nearly invisible to sharks and other aggressive fish. Just don't attack them or get too close, and they'll ignore you. The effect lasts ten minutes. You just need bug repellent and seagrass. Alright. Good to know. Alright, so we got Kiara and Sphinx. Before we go out, let's check out our Rhino. This is the the max level adult that we tamed. Okay, this guy has some speed on him. 3100. That's gotta be with the charge. Alright, let's um let's do some damage like without the charge buff. 353. Yep, 405. Alright. That was a 135. Wait, can we shoot off the back of you? We can shoot off the back of you. Interesting. But I think I'm going to take the lion out because it's more agile. Oh, and we just plow through trees. That's awesome. So yeah, that's the rhino for you guys. Got a pretty big saddle. If we wanted to, we could breed these two up and get an imprinted version. If we wanted to. Do we want to? I'm not sure. Wait, why am I in bare feet? Oh no, I'm wearing chitin shoes, that's why. Alright, um... Let's take... Sphinx out. And we're gonna see if we could find this spider. I think it's... It was a 140, I think? Let me just make sure I'm recording. Alright, I always have to check if I'm recording, because... Sometimes it's just... Alright, so if... Unless I find any ghillie armor in, like, drops, or if we get some organic polymer from, like, any penguins or mantises or whatever spawns on this map, we don't know what spawns on this map. So, like, anything goes, really. Like, this is... I'm new to this map, so I don't know everything that there is to know about it. Alright, let's just keep going. Yeah, you're definitely a lot quicker. What level is this raptor? A 130 female... We tame a quick raptor. You are a beautiful color, actually. Alright, just tank him, Sphinx. Just tank him. Wait a minute, I have a bola. Alright, wait, I think he'll go down. Yep, he's down. Or she's down. Alright, do we have any prime? We do have prime. You should tame very quickly. Alright, we'll get this 130 raptor tamed up. I think the one we have is a male. Yeah, I think Muldoon is a male, so we don't have to worry about Muldoon too much. Alright, let's see if we can locate this, um, what's it called, uh, spider. We got a blue drop here, let's see what's in it. Gilly armor? A sickle? I'll definitely take a sickle. We got a primitive and a, um, journeyman. We got hide gloves. You know, I think these will be better, because the fur gloves, they're nice and all, but I think we'll use them for, like, the snow biome and whatever. 
Alright, I don't see any more dr Oh, well that's cool. We can turn while jumping. That's pretty cool, actually. The raptor can't do that. Oh, I did not like that. I'm gonna save that. Like, I thought the game crashed for a second there. I did not like that. There's the max level Diamantinosaur. You can tame it with exceptional kibble or sweet veggie cakes. We don't have that at the moment. A 140 Argentavis. We could tame an Argentavis if we wanted to. So we could have, like, a better flyer. I'll tell you what. If the spider doesn't work out, we'll tame the Argentavis. Alright, I'm not sure exactly where the spider is. Alright, we got a couple of levels. Let's go into melee a bit. We got some raw carrots. Probably from that drop. They'll probably last longer. No, not much. 14 minutes, alright. So as long as we find this spider relatively quickly, we should be able to get this done. Hopefully. Now, I believe there was like a T-Rex. That's a beautiful Overaptor level 20. There was like a T-Rex over there. I think there was a, a Diplo over there. And there used to be a Majungasaurus. There's a purple drop here. All right. I kind of want to get this drop here because if we can get some ghillie armor from drops, that would be very convenient. I don't know where the snow biome is, nor do I know where any, like, mantises... Do mantises spawn on this map? I really don't know. Yeah. I don't know. You guys would have to let me know in the comments. There's gotta at least be a snow biome. At least. Because almost every map has one. I guess... Well, of course, with the exception of, uh, Scorched Earth and Aberration, for obvious reasons, and Genesis 2. And Fjordr is just... One giant snow biome. That's basically what it is. Because it's like freezing at nighttime. Alright, Sphinx, you stay right here. Let's see what we got. What's that, a uh, Caprasuka saddle? And some building materials. Alright, whatever. Yeah, I'm not... 100% sure where the spider was, but it's like, I know it's just out in the open. I think it's in the, uh, the mountain area. There's the max level Nothosaurus. We'll keep you in mind. I should probably check out your stats. What do you like? Alright, um, 23 into health and 31 into melee. The melee could be really good. Alright, we'll have to get some power generators and see what you're all about. But for now, let's just, uh, find this spider. Hello, Gecko. Level 100. You have a baby. There's the baby. I kind of want a shoulder pet. Alright. Come here, buddy. You're only a level 100, but you know what? You're okay. You're good to go. Alright. We'll let that grow up, and then we'll use that as a shoulder pet from now on. Alright, I remember there being a 145 Diplo here as well. That's a 55 Rex. That's a 100 with a baby. I think that's it. Yeah, this is it. This is it. Now let's try killing everything in the area. Alright. I'm sorry, Mr. T-Rex. You have to go. You're a beautiful color. And I'm about to kill the baby as well. Sorry. Nothing personal, it's just business. Alright, now. Will we be able to tame this without the ghillie armor? Or bug repellent for that matter. Or the shield. I know we do need- wait, did I check your gender? You are a female, okay. Because I know you have to tame the female before you can tame the male. Alright, you stay right there. I'm gonna see if I can feed you. Without you aggroing to me. Alright, you're aggroed. Alright. You're aggroed. I don't think it is allowing me to feed it. Hmm. I don't know if we'd have to make the shield or not. What the? Was that a Bars Boldia? That is a Bars Boldia. Okay, I'm only taming one if there's a baby. Because that taming method is, I don't know, horrible. The only reason the rock elemental was easy was because it just kept 
staying in that one spot and I kept getting headshot after headshot. All right, the spider, I believe, is still aggroed to us. So, yeah, I think we do need the shield. Have the shield out. So I'll tell you what. Let me go back to base, see if I could find another Thorax spider, and then see if I can make the shield with the iridescent chitin. I believe you are still chasing me. What the hell is wrong with you? All right, I will see you guys in a little bit. All right, and we're back. So I managed to get some ghillie armor from a drop, and I got a complete set. I also got the shield, so hopefully we'll be able to do this. Um, all right, there's the spider. No, no, no. Hey, no. I don't want to kill it by accident. All right, it's dead. It's dead. That's a Dimorphodon. What level is this Natho? You are a 145 female. Okay, with uh, 25 into health, 33 into melee. I'm gonna have to keep that in mind. That seems really good. Oh no, there's the 145 Diplo. It just ended up down here for some reason. Okay, Sphinx, you stay there. All right, we got the shield. So now it thinks we're a spider. And there we have it. Thorax spider has been tamed. All right, that was a lot harder than it needed to be. I'll, I'll say that much. That was a lot harder than it needed to be. Let's check its stats. The, the melee is probably going to be terrible because it only had like 19 points into melee pre-tamed. So I'm not expecting it to have really good melee. But we'll take a look anyway. So I guess we'll, uh, I'll see you guys back at base where we'll look at our spider and then we'll go from there. That is a beautiful saber tooth, level 60. Alright, so I'll see you guys back at base. That 145 Nothosaurus was a female, so if this max level is a male, then we could tame them and maybe breed them up, get an imprinted version, and see what they're all about. All right, let's see what level this, or um, gender this Nothosaurus is. You are also a female, all right? So I think the female, the 145 had slightly better melee. You know what, we'll tame both anyway. Once we get power generators, we'll tame both. Whether we get them from drops or whether we create them. We should have the oil from that shark. We'll be able to get the gasoline. That's not a problem. Uh, I think the generator you do need a fabricator for. So we're going to have to get a fabricator at some point. I am planning on moving base at some point. So don't worry about that. There's a drop here. Let's see if we can get this drop. I'm taking advantage of all the drops. We got some refining forges. Okay. Another amber pedestal. You know what? I'll take that. I'll take that loot. So it looks like you do need the shield to tame the spider, which is very good to know. Very good to know. All right, so I think the max level, wherever the max level Diamantinosaur is, all right, we'll go back to base, and then we'll head over and tame that 140 Argentavis. So we can at least have a really good flyer anyway. So we can fly around, scout the map, and then maybe switch over to the... to the Smilodon or the Lion whenever we find something worthy of taming. So yeah, we are back at base, and we are going to check out our spider's stats, because that's the main thing we wanted, the spider. Why don't I just use the spider to knock stuff out? We'll be saving a lot of ammo doing that. Just bump it up into melee, switch it over to poison, and we should be good to go. Alright. Sphinx, you stay here. Alright, what stats does our spider have? We can take this off, I guess. And then I guess change back into our normal clothes. I really wish I had my own chibi, or my own mask. I feel like as an ARC YouTuber, I deserve that. I may not be as well known as, say, Syntac or the Axeman, but I think I deserve it. Alright, let's check out the Raptor first. 33 into health, 35 into stamina, oxygen food, no one cares, 31 into weight, 24 into melee. Ooh, you got terrible melee. I think Muldoon may have had better melee. Uh, 24, no, they have the exact same melee. 
So we might have to get, like, a male with, like, better melee at least. But at least now you have a pack mate, Muldoon. Alright, let's see what stats we got for the spider. We got... 40 points into health, that seems pretty good. 37 into stamina, oxygen food, no one cares. 38 into weight, and 30 into melee. Actually, the melee is better than I thought it would be. I thought maybe it'd have like 25 points into melee, but no, this guy has 30. Alright, so this is our spider. We are very heavy at the moment, probably because of all the stuff we collected. Alright, our gecko had 22 into health, 12 into stamina, oxygen food, no one cares, 17 into weight, 17 into melee. But then again, this one was a baby with without the bonus levels. So now we should have a, a shoulder pet anyway. There we go. We got a little shoulder pet. Look at how it just clings on to my back. That's so cute. All right. Hold on. What's your gender? You are a male. All right. Well, the only name I can think of with you is 15. You can be 15. You know, as in 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. Hopefully if I have them on my back, I can save 15% or more on car insurance. If only I had a car. Alright. So, uh, we got a couple of metal, probably from a drop. I would imagine from a drop. Alright, let's get some wood if we have any. We do have wood. Alright, let's get a stack of that, cook up the metal, and then we should be good to go. Take out the ingots that we have. And then just keep it there for future use. Alright, we'll put that away. And then we'll go after that 145 um, Argentavis. See if that's worth it. So the 145 Argentavis. Actually, we should we should take this guy out for a spin first. Take him out for a spin. See what he's all about. I mean, we've tamed this spider before. We know what this guy's all about. Alright, we just bounced into the water. That was pretty funny. <laughs> I'll try to add a sound effect in. Alright, I forget what it is. Okay, so, uh, hold R for the gecko's wheel, okay? Uh, toggle pounce, R, X, C, alright? Toggle bite type. Alright, we're on torpor. So how much torpor do we do with a level 90 parasaur? Two bites and it's down. Yo, we should definitely use the spider to knock things out. I should utilize that a bit. Alright, let's uh, switch over to the melee and see how much damage we do with the melee. Alright, so here's a level 20 Parasaur. 163. Not bad. Yo, if we just level up melee, then we'll be like gods. We'll have like a godly spider. You know, I'm going to take a picture for the thumbnail. You know, I kind of want you out in the open. Alright, let's level that up. That'll be episode 4's thumbnail. Alright. So now that we're getting one pretty much early game, we can just jump. Ah, uh, game. Game. Thank you. Alright, can I shoot off the back of you? I can shoot off the back of you, which is pretty awesome. Alright. So that's our spider. I do believe we can climb. Oh, right click is to toggle climbing. Alright, that's good to know. Good to know. Alright. Alright, so the spider is pretty awesome. Kind of poopy colors, but apart from that, our elite power, we got mad hops though. Mad hops. Alright, so we won't use the spider just yet. So maybe when we like tame a T-Rex, I might like use the spider to knock it out. See if I can use that. Alright, let's see if we can get you to 10,000 health. Maybe put three points into melee and then put some weight in. Okay, we just released some pheromones, I believe. Yeah, I believe that was the pheromone we released. Alright, we need names for the spider, which is really cool. So, any name suggestions for the spider, let me know in the comments down below. Alright, let's go find that Argentavis. I'm also going to look out for any raptors with, like, better melee. The health seems decent. I mean, we could get one with, like, better health at some point. But, like, the melee is the main thing I want. And those not the sores could have potential. So, we'll tame both, see what they're all about with the melee, and then maybe we'll get a male to go with it with, like, very high health. And then we could have some, like, very killer not the sores. That could be pretty awesome. I do plan on taming a male spider at some point. 
We do need the female to tame the male, but if we do find a high level male, I'd be inclined to tame it. Alright, there's a red drop over here. What we could do is knock out this RG, and if the red drop is still there, we'll collect it. Unless it's like across the water, then I don't really want to mess with that one. So, alright. I don't see the red drop anywhere. It must have disappeared. There's the max level Diamantinosaur. 140. Alright, what level is this raptor? 85. To kill you. Yeah, get the RG's attention. Get it down here. We could use the spider for this and try and knock it out. No, don't attack the sauropod. Oh, I hit it by accident. Crap. Please don't wake up. 25 into health. It could have decent health. Oh, no, it's waking up. Please go down. All right, down goes the RG. Awesome. Okay, that could be... All right, I don't think the... All right, I don't think he's mad at us. I don't think the Diamantinosaur is mad at us. That's good. All right, do we have any Prime on us? We do have Prime. All right. All right, there is a Compi after us. Let's kill you. All right, I think the Diamantinosaur is... Uh, passive? I don't want you attacking this guy. All right, let's see. Okay, your taming effectiveness is fine. All right, so I'm going to sit here and wait for this RG to tame. How much melee did it have? 25 and I don't think I could see the melee at the moment because it's knocked out. All right, well, we'll have to see. So I will see you guys when this Argentavis is fully tamed. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. And there we have it. Argentavis has been tamed. Let's go ahead and collect this stuff. We'll take it back to base. Sorry about shooting you by accident, buddy. That'll never happen again. Now that I've gotten what I wanted, that uh, 145 Argentavis. All right, let's check out the Argentavis' stats. Let's see what we got for the RG stats. All right, so we've got 38 points into health. That doesn't seem too bad. 27 into stamina, it's kind of got poor stamina. Oxygen food, no one cares. 41 into weight, 38 into melee. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. We got a pretty decent Argentavis. All right, so let's get some of the hide and the keratin out. Let's see if we could tame this uh, guy. All right, that's hide taken care of. That's fiber taken care of. We just need a bit more keratin. All right, do you have any keratin on you, buddy? You do. Awesome. Muldoon, you are an absolute legend. You are an absolute legend, Muldoon. Good boy. Let's wait for the RG saddle to be crafted. Let's take you out for a spin. See what you're all about. All right, we had a turtle here for our enemies. 223. Not bad. Not bad at all. And now we can pick some stuff up, right? Like, we could pick an RG up with, or a Listro up with no problem. That's a 140 Listro. 670. That that had to have been a headshot. That had to have been a headshot. Okay, you're just going to float in the air? All right. Let me get into position so I can harvest you. There we go. Let's pick up a Dodo. Kill it. 449. Yeah, that's got to be a headshot. What else could that be? That's got to be a headshot. All right, so we got... Let's get that up to 1,000 stamina. Maybe 2,000. Yeah, 2,000 stamina. 10,000 health for now. Maybe 1,000 weight. And then put the rest in the melee. 308 or 60. Not bad. Not bad at all. Let's get some more melee going. All right, I think stamina's fine. I think weight is fine. We just need to level up the melee and maybe the health a bit more. But I might do that on my spare time. I don't know. All right, so we got a new flyer. An Argentavis, which is really cool. Sphinx has been an absolute legend so far. You have carried us out through the series really so far. 
really good so far. All right. You do you, Sphinx. You do you. All right, so we have some more metal. We got 35 metal. We should be good to go. Next episode, what do I want to do next episode? Oh, we got a better shirt. So what do I want to do next episode? And we got some better shoes. Hmm. What we could do... Maybe go after something a little bit bigger? Maybe like a T-Rex or something? I, I don't know. I do feel lucky. I do feel lucky. Maybe we could go after a T-Rex. The spider is definitely cool. I'll probably use you to tame the T-Rex. The but apart from that, maybe we'll just uh, do whatever, so. Alright. And with that, I think that's going to have to wrap it up for this episode. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. But until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.